Hello, everyone. Oh, hi. G'day. Hello. <laughs> How are all of you? How are you doing? Yeah. We're playing some Planet Zoo. Yay, Planet Zoo. I'm excited. Um, I am in my headphone edition again. And also, I'm excited to build some, uh, build some new zoos in a special <gasps> new timed mode that the game has. Yes. Which is so how does that be. work? So you have a certain amount of time to complete a whole list of objectives. So that's mm -hmm. like um, building habitats, building like a river ride, uh, getting your zoo up to a certain like star rating, making a certain amount of money. Um, it's And considering how much you know I love timed modes, I can't see <laughs> any way in which this will go wrong. This isn't going to be stressful at all. No, not at all. I don't think it's going to be stressful in the slightest. So uh, oh. this is the new time scenario, the first one you get, called Castmire. I've already had a quick Ooh. look at it to see what we have to do. Uh, and, oh god. The good so we thing have is, to, like, turn a bog into a zoo? Yeah, effectively. Wow. So, like, no pressure or anything, but, yeah, that's that's the aim here. <laughs> Um, Look at all the animations, they're just so cute. They're so adorable, they're so good. I was trying to build an ape zoo when I was uh, practicing a while back and all of my monkeys kept escaping and it was <laughs> doing my head in, so I'm gonna- They're pretty clever. They are very clever. I'm gonna try to build some monkey enclosures here, but they're probably gonna like just absolutely die. Oh, but yeah, no. the Australia pack, uh, which is out today, I believe. Yay. So I'm very excited to uh, give it a go. Uh, oh, I don't know, we're going down under, see some animals, some you, uh, kangas. You had to some, do, you had to do it. Some wombats. You couldn't yeah, do it. I'm allowed to do it, by the way. Yeah, so, you're allowed you know, to, okay. I've, I've, I'm married into Australian fam an Australian it's family, so right. it's fine. <laughs> so yeah, here's our bog. This is the bog that we're going to try and turn into a... Uh, wow, oh my gosh. Uh, zoo which should be fine. it's a bog not a feature exactly or, no way <laughs> it's a <laughs> way around <laughs> wrong way around um so yeah here are all our objectives uh the clock is already ticking here so if we want to do like kind of okay we should do it in one minute and 45 which is kind of the length of the stream which is okay okay um, one hour 45 exactly yeah Yes. So these are all the things we've got to do. So this one, I did a quick practice at this earlier and it takes a while. So instead I'm going to focus on these ones. And we can come back to that one later. Okay. Um, so the first thing we need in order to be able to actually have oh, uh, so many, there's so many things. I love all the menus. I can tell you something. I really needed to practice this, which I did because otherwise <laughs> I would be so thrown out. Okay. So first thing we need is an animal trade center because uh, that's how we right. get all of the animals. So let me just- Buy, sell, Do quit lying to me. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Here's our animal trade center. Let's, uh, it's quite nice how it just locks together with all the uh, little walkways and stuff. Yeah, it's, for some reason, it doesn't want me to uh, build here. No, get rid of that, please. Okay, let's try this one instead. This one build last okay. time. Okay. Uh, Why does yeah. it not, oh. It's just fussy. Which I can identify okay. with, to be honest, so it's fine. <laughs> okay. You're not just going to build it anywhere. No way, not going to do that. The best of the best. Absolutely not. Um, so now we've got an animal trade center, we can see the animals that we can have here. So <gasps> there's- Wow, that's a lot of bison. So, buffalo. so many different animals. I'm going to pause this here because oh I don't want time gosh. to go on what we're building. Um, oh, right. Yeah, because otherwise some of them have timers on them. So like seven oh, minutes no. left to adopt. Yeah. Oh no! And I'm I'm not uh, I'm not into the t everything being timed when we play this. <laughs> um, but yeah, so look at all wasn't... these different animals we can wow. adopt. Wow, tons, loads. So what wasn't there a thing when this first came out where the online element was kind of broken because people were just like they were only trading in like in like j weird uh, warthogs and just really? cheap animals. Oh god! Yeah, they were like. Everyone was just turfing like all these kind of weird emus and warthogs like oh, that nobody wanted because uh, oh, the that... economy was kind of broken. It was it was really funny because I think it was um, Nate Crowley on uh, oh, yeah. Rock Paper Shotgun wrote a thing about it and it was very very funny. Oh man, that is absolutely devastating though. All oh, the poor animals yeah. just not wanted to be adopted. I know. So they're just a bit gnarled. Yeah, I think. I think what what first off, Aoife, what animal do you want to build an enclosure for first? I mean, what habitat why, are you into? Well, well, I'm just, I'm, I'm just always about the big cats. Big um, cats. Okay, so we've got some lions. Do you want to jump straight to the top of the food chain? Yeah. 
some lions. I think yeah. there's some other ones in here as well. Other cats. Uh, I saw them earlier. <gasps> Where are they? There we go. Cheetahs. Cheetahs. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Technically not a big cat. But, are they uh, not? Well, they're not part of the Panthera genus. Oh. So uh, yes, they're actually oh like God. in their own little. Uh, yeah, they're because well because they don't have retract or they yeah they don't have retractable claws like other cats. Oh, and actually, okay. genetically, they're quite close to dogs in that sense. Okay. Um, you're going to find out that I am insufferable about animals uh, in this stream, just FYI. You know all the things. You used to be really into it, didn't you, when you were younger? Yeah, I, I'm super, still super into animals. I love learning about, um, oh, oh, just just all about them. Amazing. So, so at the moment, yeah. we don't have enough, um, like, I think this is research points to adopt them. They're too expensive. So okay. we need to focus on the ones we can adopt that have uh, dollar yeah. signs next to them. Oh, I see. Oh, right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because there's two different kinds of currency in this, mm -hmm. right? Exactly. There's yeah. like dollar dues and then there's also uh yeah the you have to put like you have to yeah. actually which is a it's, nice thing about this game is that you can't just buy everything like as soon as you start the game well that you actually have to give back like yes. in terms of conservation to be able to uh because it's not i think that was something that they really pushed with this game that it's not just about building a big zoo it's also a, like they're trying to teach you about you know conservation yeah. and and like looking after the animals and the ecology exactly. Which is why um, some of these, like, when you adopt stuff for cash, you can't re-release it back into the wild. So mm. it's why stuff that can be released into the wild is a lot more expensive. Yeah. So and, let's have a and look. I ha oh, yeah. And I have seen that we have an actual zookeeper in the chat. <gasps> oh, uh, man. Liam, Liam Tunward's in the chat. So, uh, Liam, let us know how uh, if you've played this game and <laughs> what you think about it. And um, we also have a few super chats. Oh, uh, one from it. Nick Dumont that says, having you two lovelies on while I get ready for work is going to be a great start to the day. Hope it keeps up. Thank you. Thanks. And uh, we also have one from Josh Perini that says it's three a.m. here. Go to bed. Yeah, go been to feeling sleep. a lot of been feeling a lot of insomnia and depressed tonight. But seeing the stream alert on my phone definitely already improved my mood. Love watching you, lovely people. Oh, thank you, Josh. I hope that um, you can get some good rest soon. Yes. Um, yes. And then we have one from Astral Dragon Gaming that says Ooh. the big question: Are there drop bears? Oh my god. Are there drop bears? <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, because I love the whole the whole sort of um, what is it like the mystery of drop bears yeah like whether the they myth, do or don't exist the legend yeah um, i'm gonna see if i can just make this terrain like come up a bit because okay oh yeah get water. rid of some of that water here's a fun fact from xenagil um male kangaroos are called boomers and females really? are flyers yeah oh my god i okay, did boomer. not know that okay boomer <laughs> oh my god that's terrible um <laughs> so you're supposed to have to remove water here but um i and instead yeah. just going to build some like i feel like we should build some we can just keep these paths going create some enclosures. i quite like the path yeah me you know? too i like them so what do you want to adopt first what should we go for here's well, all the things we can actually afford okay what can here. we afford yeah uh, um camels some red pandas i'm trying uh, to think what would actually thrive in this environment you know mm -hmm. like camels i don't think so because well it's not very it's not a very deserty yeah. surrounding there are um, things maybe we can there are things we can put in to heat up the area and cool it down. So okay. it's, it's okay if we adopt something that needs a bit more like cold, really. How about some crocs? Crocs, yeah, let's go for crocs. Okay, what's the cheapest crocodile here? Species, uh, okay. Let's find them. Saltwater crocodiles, which are up here somewhere. Up, 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 up. Salt water. Do we actually have to change? like the? Because this isn't going to be salt water, is it? Oh, that's so... a really good point. Uh, mm. Saltwater crocodiles. Uh, let's have a look at the Nazupedia and see what it says. Yeah. Habitat. Look at all these things. Aquatic. Oh. Research data. Species. I love this stuff. It's so nerdy. There's so many things. So many things. Uh, I feel like let's let's give it a go and then we can always return them if we don't, if it doesn't okay. go too well. So a let's... reticulated giraffe. Yeah. Yes, you are. You are so reticulated. Okay. These, uh, let's start with this one. This one's, yeah, pretty cheap. Okay. So first I want to build a place for it. So we should definitely build some like fences and stuff because yeah. I am not particularly optimistic about the idea of a saltwater crocodile just wandering around. Maybe it just wants to make friends, you know? Maybe it does, maybe it does. Just death roll its way around. <laughs> okay, uh, I think that's the same path. Yeah, right. Let's build this path to go all the way ooh, 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 over here. Wee! Looks over. cool. It does I like look this. cool, doesn't it? Where should we build it? So I think these are the boundaries of our park, so we can't go below this. Oh, I see. Okay. So instead, 
I'm Where is this to... park? Do we know? Like, is this park in a particular part of the world? Uh, it's in Estonia, I think. Ooh. I think. Okay, let's make this the, uh, the the crocodile enclosure. Yes. Over here. So I'm just going to build a path to show it and then probably build some barriers to make sure said crocodiles can't get out. Yes. Uh, steel mesh. Chain link. What? Oh, it's what, cool what though. That's pretty. Sorry, yeah, because I, yeah, I do. No, I, I, you're totally right. I want it to be pretty because it's almost like the walkways do separate the, you know, the animals from the people, and it, yeah. it's really cool that they could almost walk through the enclosure a little bit. Exactly. Okay, so I think we could like build it around here. Just make mm. sure. So when I first built my first enclosure, I was like, oh, the pass will act as a barrier. No, they won't. They don't. Oh no. Okay. They I'm very... glad you did that research ahead yes. of time because I would have assumed that too. <laughs> no, they do not act as a barrier, which is why I'm now. I feel like they should though. Like if, yeah. the, if the zoo was doing it properly, you could put like a mesh under the walkway so that people don't see it. Exactly. But it's still there. There was like some um, some terrain that I thought would block off the enclosure for the animals, mm -hmm. but again, no, cannot be sure. <laughs> uh, so let me just complete this one. Beep. There we go. Yeah. There. Okay, so now we have an enclosure. Um, I don't think I need to raise the level of it because uh Well it's crocs, it's... they don't they can't jump. So. Exactly. Can you imagine? Oh my god. Oh <laughs> no. Okay, so we've got um this enclosure. Now I need to build an entrance for a keeper. So I might actually Aww. get rid so of these. So adorable. So adorable. Um have so you been to many zoos? No, not really. I like there weren't really many good ones around where I was. Like, I think, oh, that's cool. Yeah. I love that. That just, like, automatically fills it's, it in for you. It makes cool. it so much easier. I love it. Um, I, I like, I, I know that some zoos play a really important part in conservation and stuff. Mm -hmm. But, um, I, yeah, I can't get behind a lot of them because I don't think they really do enough. Yeah. It's kind of tricky, um, isn't it? It is tricky. And that's why I, I quite like this game, the way that it's pitched it, because it's like... It's saying, you know, it actually has protesters in this yes. game that if you aren't taking good enough care of the animals and, you know, the animals are suffering, um, the game actually makes a statement that, yeah. you, you know, you need to do more. Um, and then you have to, like, in, you have to in, in, uh, improve your facilities because it's, just, yes. it's not good enough, essentially. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because okay, I, I think, like, the, you know, some zoos are doing important research and important work in, you know, um, preserving a lot of. Uh, at-risk species yeah and you know it's if if kind of getting the public interested in animals and their welfare is is you know a means to to getting more funding to continue conservation and things like that yeah um absolutely we should, you know we should do that you know it's so so important like you really can't yeah. neglect it just because it's it's i think it's one of the ways that makes zoos kind of okay to visit in my head it's like okay yes. they are actually doing something yeah, exactly. Nice. And it, if they are, it, it eases my mind as well that if like the animals are work, well cared for, and you know they're they're having fun and they're they're being stimulated and everything, yeah. um, then it's kind of a win win situation. They're being looked after. Their species is being looked after. Exactly. Kids get excited about animals, which I love to see. And they can just um, they can just like educate people on what it's actually what to how these animals cope in wildlife and stuff. So exactly. It's not just about yeah. Entertaining people. It's actually about doing other stuff as well. Definitely. Okay. Right. Oh, look at the cute little eyes. I'm just building some staff paths. There we what go. is that little house there? So this is a keeper hut. So it means okay. that um, the keepers who come to look after the crocodiles can kind of get all their resources and stuff here. Cute. It also means that I can uh, make this a work zone, where, so you can assign specific staff to specific work zones, so oh, they I kind see. of know what to do and stuff. So anyway, you can't basically you can't build an enclosure without a keeper gate. So now that I've got mm -hmm. an enclosure here for the keepers. Um, I need to make sure. By the way, okay. Flurgle Hinge says crocodiles absolutely can jump, so we might be they in can? trouble. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Just to be on the safe side, then, because uh, your animals, as I have learned, do escape in this. Yeah. Uh, also, David Whitfield says that we're, while we're discussing conservation, the chat is discussing eating Australian animals. Oh, so come we've gone on to now. Different paths here. Come, come on, on, guys. We expect. I actually so have had kangaroo you. before. I've have you? How did it taste? Yeah. Well, it was, um, it was like, uh, it was almost like jerky or it was smoked. So oh, it was okay. kind of, it was quite nice, actually. It was very salty. Yeah. But, I can't, know. I don't I imagine, I've had crocodile before and it tasted like salty chicken. 
Salty fish Yeah, I've chicken. heard that about it. Yeah. yeah, it's almost like a cross between chicken and fish. Exactly, yeah. Right, let's adopt a crocodile and see how it likes this place then. Uh, <gasps> I hope it'll be happy. Me too. This one? Yeah. I don't care. We're not breeding anything, so I don't care about the fertility. <laughs> so I'm going to get lucky. The zoo and pull it in here. There we go. I uh, love the way their little boxes cut. They just like bump. They just bump just come up. Out of these little things. Yeah. And I'm going to hire a keeper as well. Uh, and do we need some uh, some toys for the yes, for the crocodile? Yes, we do. I just wanted to make sure that I had okay work zone. Let me create a work zone. Stop walking around. My thing. This is like, can everyone just stop? Just just everyone chill out a minute. Stop moving Ooh, around. What's this? This is a work oh, this is... zone. Oh. Uh, I need a staff room, but I'll deal with that in a bit. Uh, okay. So basically, <laughs> they can wanna... wait. Yeah, they can wait. They don't need that. The work zone can be work zone one. So what this means is that now I can click on this keeper and say, uh, the only thing I want you to do is work on work zone one. So he'll just look after the oh, crocodiles I see. and stuff. Is that his name? Monte Meadows? Yes, Monte Meadows. Oh, which is just a great it. name. I absolutely <laughs> adore it. Um, so he'll do that. So now the crocodile's on the way. I am pretty sure it's not going to like some of this vegetation and stuff. So we might have to add some enrichment right. stuff. Because so. we do, yeah, oh, that's it, enrichment. Because you do, they get happier if you um, include uh, like plants and, and, and foliage and uh, yes. fauna that are from their uh, neck of the woods, yeah. right? That's <laughs> like, yeah, they, they, it makes them much, much happier. Um, so yeah. they can actually, and I'll mark it, here we go, council move. So it is being moved here. Um, yeah, it just makes them a lot happier. So they, they like, and the visitors like it as well. Yeah. Um, right, let's see what else we have to do in this. So. 10 habitat species oh my god okay <laughs> right this is probably ah! fine uh so that's yeah. one uh once the thing gets there so what else shall we build let me pause this mm. uh let's look at the animals okay price uh go down the things we can afford how about <laughs> some ball some nice some yeah or some warthogs or maybe some maybe like a nice flock of flamingos because flamingos, flamingos like water as well right like, so. i love that one yeah let's have a look and see what they like they love a bit of water <laughs> they love some water tropical Ooh. aquatic temperate grassland okay gotta have at least 125 meters squared and they don't need any climbing okay that's good so let's where should we build our flamingo place hmm. i think they're gonna look so pretty they're gonna look very pretty um <laughs> I want to build a river. You gotta do a riverboat ride, and I think the best place to do that would be like here. That would be amazing. Because then yeah. you can go all the way around and stuff. So yes. Um, but then I'm like, can you, can you build flamingos like on the way to a riverboat ride with the riverboat not get in the way? I feel like you should be able to. Flamingos are pretty chill. Like they'll just, they'll just uh, hang out. They right? won't just like, escape. That's they're my not worry. stupid. Yeah. Oh right, I see. That's my issue. But um. If I build a river ride, like, let me find it. Okay, if with the, yeah, okay. If this is the loop for the river ride, then we can just build the river ride like here, and then we yeah. can use this for the flamingos. So let's yeah, do that. love it. Okay. The zoo where I grew up, uh, well, the closest zoo where I grew up, they had a thing where um, the they used to have an enclosure for like I think it was meerkats, oh, yeah? and the meerkats eventually dug their way out of the enclosure. Oh but my god. But they dug it into like the public kind of it was like a like a little square thing, and they didn't go any further. So the zoo just kind of let them get on with it. Okay, I kind so of you love could go that. to the zoo and there'd just be meerkats just being like, "What's up? Hey, What's how you doing? On? You good? Yeah, <laughs> that is incredible. I think they got quite fat though because people were feeding them. So. Oh, wouldn't you though? If you see a meerkat coming on, you yeah. can't like turn it down and say, "Oh no, I'm not going to give you all the things, you cute little bastard." So adorable. Okay, I'm gonna make this quite high because i'm pretty sure flamingos can fly and i am not into that come on there you go. <laughs> jake franklin says yes as a british guy celebrating 17 years in australia oh. next month i've got a weird sense of pride from this stream Yay. fyi cro crocodiles are powerful jumpers and kangaroos can total cars if hit kangaroos are hench it's kind of creepy when they're, they're just like when like an actual bodybuilder. When you see him walking around and you're like, oh my god, okay, you're quite dangerous. <laughs> Let's keep doing this around here. Come on. There we go. All the way down. Oh boy. Because I don't want the flamingos to go away. So I'm going to no. make this high. Okay, come on, this one. This one here. 
and people will be able to see into this enclosure quite easily yes uh so let me just raise this up yeah Ooh. so basically people will be able to see through here although maybe we should maybe we should build like a like a, a viewing platform or yeah, something platform. yeah okay let me do that then uh gotta make sure we got the same type of wood i'm i can't be having these different types no of i know words. i'm I can't right it. there with you okay let's make this a little viewing platform then there we go yep and nice. then more barriers okay so now i need to build barriers this is what i did last time i was like oh but they won't be able to get out because you know animals aren't smart <laughs> <Just> <laughs> stupid life finds a way exactly Ew. no Aoife. Aoife. <laughs> Yes. I'm gonna make this a bit smaller. Aoife, yes. Aoife, no! Come <laughs> <laughs> around here. Oh, turn this around. There we go. And let's make this longer again. Boop, boop, boop. boop. There we go. Uh, you can probably see over that if you're walking around. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you totally can. I might make this bit tiny. Yeah, bit you lower. can. Yeah. Thing is, guests are bitches. And they are, they're, they're so fussy. They are so fussy. It's like, oh, I can't see them from they're here. They're like, well, like, I, paid my, I paid my $50 for yeah. my ticket, so I want to see all the things. Like, get on, just get on your tiptoes. Stop complaining and get on your tiptoes. Oh, my God. Oh, Monica says, thankfully, they tell you how high your enclosure needs to be so the animals won't escape. You just need to make sure the ground, the ground isn't too high in some yeah, places. Yeah, exactly. I did have a look at the flamingos and I couldn't see anything, but I feel like... When the but can't they actually... fly? That's Wouldn't the thing. That... It's like, uh, well, you know what? We're gonna try. God damn it! We're just gonna try. <laughs> to keep them in check. We'll worry about that later. Exactly. Let's build a keeper hut. Uh... Has our crocodile arrived yet? So I've had it on pause because. Oh uh, right, got gotcha. you. Just so so I can build this stuff and then we we'll, like activate it. There we go. These it's just that gif of Scott Pilgrim sitting by the front door, just waiting for our yeah. crocodile. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Cool. Right. Uh, and Do you have oh. to have a keeper hut for every enclosure? Um, not for every one, but it's quite far away from the crocodiles. So I right, just wanted yeah. to make sure there's like its own one. Oh, that's true. So it means that this one could probably serve like a keeper enclosure here as well. Mm. Um, okay. So let's adopt some relocating to Habat Habitat 2. Okay. Let's play this. There we go. Uh, let's adopt some flamingos. Flamingos! Never say die. Uh, okay. Adopt into the zoo. Here. And a then. Greater flamingo. I think we should have at least two. Yes, no, you quite definitely social do. Social young animals. We need a flock, like. There we go. A flock of flamingos. A flock of flamingos. Okay. Um, this place isn't exactly outfitted for guests yet, but again, I will deal with that later. Here's our crocodile. Did you know? Oh! You're gonna put them in? Comes. Did you know that flamingos are not naturally pink, but the it's their food source turns them pink? Really? Oh my god. Yes. I did not know that. Okay, and did you also know that you can tell the difference between an alligator and a crocodile by looking at their teeth? Really? How? So, How does that work? Because the fourth tooth on an alligator or a crocodile's snout... Now, I'll have to double check if this is the case. But basically, the fourth tooth in each of them... Uh, I think it's alligator teeth come down and crocodile oh, really? teeth stick up. Yeah. Oh my god, that is kind of terrifying. Yeah, pretty cool though. Imagine being able to get close enough to uh, the animals to actually realize that that's the thing that you need. A tooth. Like, yeah. <laughs> come on. Okay, there's our staff room. Okay, I know I need all that stuff, but not right now. That's the point. Oh, Infelixor says, Scientists proved this year that flamingos have best friends Aww. and you need to keep their friends together or else they get sad. Cute. Uh, I love that. That's really adorable. Also, Shift Shift says, Flamingos can drink boiling water. How did they find that out? How? How who was feeding like How? boiling cups of tea to flamingos? Where? <laughs> when? Is, is it animal? because they kind of they kind of have like a grate on their belt their beaks, don't they? Yeah, what and they just filter Almost it like out, a, you think? Yeah, 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 yeah. Almost like some whales have. Th that is uh, yeah, I can't believe that. They filter <laughs> stuff out. Oh my god. Power source inaccessible. Okay. Animals are animals are nature's awesome. Nature um, is awesome. There's so much that it can get obvious. done. <laughs> uh, oh, Horatio Potato Face says, just got my Happy Hour Tavern Time pen in the mail. Yay! Yay! Oh my god, amazing. I've got mine somewhere in my uh, 
Oh boy, okay, this is the wrong way around. That's why you're getting What's that a generator? Yeah, it's a generator so it can power stuff around. Okay. Uh, let me nice. move this. Uh move turn around. Turn around. Bright eyes. Okay, that's fine. Every now and then I've build a <laughs> generator. Yeah. That's definitely the way the song goes, <laughs> I think. Yeah, that's yeah, that's for that's sure. Weird. Yeah. There we go. Okay, now it's accessible. Where are flamingos from originally? Is it Where are flamingos from? They're I think they're African but also like you get them in some parts. Is it are they from like Florida and stuff? Maybe? Yeah. I don't well. know. I, I actually don't know. I need to like learn more about um the animals and stuff, which I should already know if I'm playing Planet Zoo, but still. <laughs> um right, where is our I hope oh. that Will Smith personally welcomes each flamingo to Mi Miami, Miami as he did in that in that uh, seminal uh, 19 no 2000 song of the same name. What are you talking about? <laughs> well, are you Smith, doing a pun? You... God damn it! Are you doing no, a pun? No, welcome to Miami. Miami, 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 Miami. Yeah. Here they are. <laughs> Oh, ha, 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 Jesus, that is a big boy. Oh, he's boy. a he's a chonker. Look at this boy. <gasps> oh my god, he is massive. That keeper's that keeper's flirting with death. Oh, I love him. Oh, I love oh. him. Oh, close the door. Get out you go. Okay, he wants food and toys, oh, which is fair enough. He's a cutie. Look at him. And he's fine being on his own. He doesn't care. Doesn't care. Oh. Okay, let's give him some food and stuff then oh look at him oh god he moves fast oh oh he does okay let's filter this by uh the giant saltwater crocodile we don't yes see what's good for him else. maybe it's just in salt water where are you saltwater crocodile there we go what do you want would you like a mud bath yes I <gasps> oh yee oh go. the blood filled pumpkin surely absolutely absolutely let's make sure that best the visitors can see him playing with that there we go he's happy now He's very happy. Yeah. Oh, yay. And hopefully this is okay water. Oh, Down man. I go. Speaking of visitors, we oh. already, they've started oh, to oh, arrive. The, I hope you guys like crocodiles and flamingos because that's <laughs> all we got here at this zoo. <laughs> While we're at it, so basically visitors are bitches, but, and, but yeah. they will donate money to your zoo if they really like it. Oh, yeah. We need some donation boxes. So we sure we sure also we need like, boxes. I feel like we need a cafe or something. Yes. We should get some stuff. So let's just, let's just remind them to do some donating while they're mm -hmm. here. One there and one there. And put some over by the flamingos. One mm. here one here there we go um right what should we build for them some everyone's dropping some some solid flamingo facts in the chat love I'm it loving it i love the facts what what kind of facts are we getting okay so uh as asashi as uh, chi chi uh, says the majority of lakes where flamingos live have extremely high salt concentrations the only source of fresh water for some of these birds comes from boiling geysers so that would be why we know oh that they God. can drink boiling water how cool is that that's incredible um and then red roses wolfa says fun flamingo fact for caribbean flamingos there's only four major breeding sites which means a large storm could knock out a lot of the population Protecting their remaining habitat is essential. Wow. Oh my god. That's terrifying. Yeah. We need to protect them. We must protect the flamingos. At, at all costs. Yes, at all costs. And uh, David Wetfield says four flamingo species are distributed throughout the Americas, including the Caribbean, and two species are native to Africa, Asia, and Europe. Oh, cool. So there's quite a lot of different types of flamingos out there. Uh, another reason why guests are bitches is that they don't like seeing star facilities because they're snotty nosed dicks. So I'm gonna, <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm just gonna cover up this place with some trees. The star facilities are cute. Look, that's they a nice are. I think structure. this looks really nice. Besides, like, yeah. I'm sorry, but if you go to a um, zoo and you're surprised that staff are looking after animals, you're a bad person. I of know. Course staff look after animals. Come on. You should be happy to see them being cared for. Exactly. Have you seen those videos that come around every so often on Twitter and stuff where it's, um, I think it's a park in China where the keeper is trying to like sweep up the leaves yes. and all the baby pandas are just making it impossible. They're such dicks. Oh, I absolutely love it. It's just so, so cute. It's so, so cute. Um, okay. <laughs> where can we build the rest of the, of the visitor facilities? We got some crocodile um... stuff. We got 
a toilet over here. That's good. To ha it's good to have toilets. Let, maybe, maybe, maybe we can there? Some stuff over here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's delete. Uh, that might be okay. Okay, some paths. Let's build. Yeah. Okay, this is the one. Every now and then I build a path. Uh, and make this go down. I only recently figured out how to make paths go down and I was like, oh my God, this is a game changer. Oh. <laughs> this is a game changer. Okay, if I build like a, oh boy. That's, that's a nice. windy old path. It's a very windy path, I wanna do this. And then once I build some facilities, we can like make sure that they all go in a little corner. This game okay. really appeals to my organizational- Oh yes, like, oh yes. Loves. Okay, let's is that an build... ATM? Yeah. Just to make sure I can get some cash out to spend on our it's money. Good. This is it says shell next to it. Is that cause uh Yeah, okay, so there's so there's not actually a shop in here yet. Um, oh okay. this is just like a little building a where you can put shops. But well, there are cute. different types of buildings. A drink this shop. is Yeah. That's okay, that's 195 quid, so I feel like that's probably worth money because I'm looking at how much money we have and yeah. we have don't have loads, so I feel like we should build a small gift shop. Where's the gift shop one? Vending machine. Vending machines. Uh, food shop. Merch. Uh, Was that merchandise shop? Back, back. Back, back, back. Here. Oh, there. Merchandise there. shop. Merchandise shop. Looney bloons. Okay, so maybe we can just buy a Looney bloons. <laughs> Looney bloons. <laughs> Looney bloons. Oh, we have a super chat from Sarah. Evening, ladies. I did my wildlife bio degree at a zoo here in Oz. Oh, wow. Fun fact. Fun fact, did you know blood samples are collected from roos out of their tail and echidnas from their nose? Oh my god, I had no idea! Oh, that's so I cute! I love all these facts! Oh my god, that's so cool! Sorry, you are uniquely placed to like tell us all all the goss on this game. Okay. Is it right? Is it correct? Is it? So good. This is definitely... what? Uh, no, I want you to go in there, please. That would be great. <laughs> so let me... Oh, echidnas are this. adorable. There we go, okay. There we go. And there's just you're in the wrong you're you're in the wrong place. You need to be in here, gal. Go on, on, off you go. No vendor. So let's hire a vendor. Zoo staff. Okay, hire a vendor. Okay. Just gonna, I just wonder, gonna float around. I suppose I'm just thinking about it now. I'm like, I suppose zookeepers were essential workers because you would have had to have, even if the zoos themselves were closed, the the animals would need looking after, right? Yeah, I th I think so. Yeah, you'd still need them to like maintain yeah. the um, area. Maybe it would have been quite nice actually to like yeah. just care for all the animals without <laughs> dealing with them, dealing with the the, the bitchy with guests, people. as you put it. Yeah. Okay, here's our flamingo. Okay, right. First off, let's absolutely pause this because I do not Aww. trust this thing. Okay, welfare. What does it want? It wants food. It looks a bit sad. It does look a bit sad. Let's fix that. Let's give it some enrichment stuff uh nature there we go nope habitat that's the one right some crocodiles yeah flamingos are amazing i always think they're um when i watch the videos of like because i do watch a lot of cute videos don't attack me of like oh uh, yeah baby flamingos trying to do like one leg up for the first time oh, it just, oh it makes my heart sing so i got really distracted there because i was like a hundred dollars for a cardboard box like just just order something from amazon just order something from yeah. Amazon and use that instead. That is outrageous. Oh my god, oh. okay, Jesus Christ. What does uh, that mean? It's quite warm? Yeah, it's yeah, quite so warm. Yeah, so this will cause the temperature. So Goodness. this is a heat map here, which will change, like, cool. it will show you how hot and warm everything is. So everything here is really hot. Um, but I think flamingos quite like the heat, so I'm not too worried about that. Yeah. Um, I think both, <gasps> like, we've been, what? A mirror mobile. Oh <gasps> my god, absolutely. Cute. We need to make sure they can like stare at themselves and love themselves. I you love know? that that's basically like a big version of what you put in like budgie cages. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> also a big version of what I have in my dressing room right now. <laughs> okay. uh, there we go, all nice and happy. Yay. Okay. Oh, look at it. Oh, oh look! look! I didn't know they did that. Oh, I didn't know... Th that's weird that I didn't really twig they swim either. I was no. like, oh, they just kind of chill, don't they? Yeah, look at it go. Okay, this, wait, 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 you're having wait, a whale wait. of a time. This is great. Okay. <laughs> and there's supposed to be another flamingo coming soon as well. Oh, yeah, he uh, needs a friend. How are you happy? Yeah, coverage is good. Good plants. Yeah. 
There doesn't seem to be that much in here, so I'm a little bit worried. I just want to make sure. Okay, hard oh. shelter. Soil okay. Soil and rock. So if I go to... I think it's... Where is it again? Rocks? No. Pretty sure it's in nature. You have to, like, paint things. Here we go. Soil. Oh, nice. Oh, I uh, like this. I'm this is quite a fun tool. Yeah. I'm gonna I really want to play this game now. <laughs> I'm telling you, it is, it's the kind of game where you sit down and you're like, I'm going to do it for an hour because I've got stuff to do. And then... No. no absolutely not. It's absolutely It just totally not. speaks to my, like, yeah, like, organization kind of, like, I just want to make everything I just perfect. make things. Okay, I'm yeah. going to put some more rock over here as well. There we go. Okay, so now all of these. It needs some hard shelter. Mm hmm So, oh, look, there's another flamingo coming. Yay! Yay. Oh, wow. Can you don't run with that box. You're going to... You're gonna Go. trip and fall and squish the flamingo. Come on. Okay, hard shelter. How many does it need to be? Did we buy a boy and a girl flamingo, or I think um... I just bought two girls? Oh, Aww. gal pals. There we go. Okay, Super now it's lesbian shelter. flamingo friends. Mm -hmm. Anyone who like? Did you see? There's that. There they are. Our other Aww. flamingo. There was that tweet. <gasps> yeah. There was that tweet that went out to celebrate the marriage of um. Uh, the actress who plays Pusey in Orange is the New Black and one of the writers. Uh, oh, really? They're, they're gay, so there's a tweet that went out that was like, oh my god, look at them in their wedding outfits. Like, they're absolutely amazing. And Aww. someone, quote, tweeted it with like, oh my god, getting married on the same day as my best friend. It Best friend goes. And it was like... No, you shut up. And it was just like, oh, sweetie, come on. No, stop this That's now. incredible. Stop. That has to be like... like you know purposeful ignorance like you, you would just hope being so because like, okay come on for some reason you're oh everyone's standing... enjoying look, looking there's i've i've done this why are you standing here okay well if you're gonna do that i'm gonna put down a donation box to remind you that you should be doing yeah some definitely money to me no, in my head canon like our flamingos are definitely a gorgeous couple because like do you remember everyone went or maybe i'm just confusing with the part with parks and rec but there was like i feel like there was uh, a new cycle where a gorgeous little gay penguin couple yes! like captured the news <laughs> yes there was oh god that was great um it was it was just yeah oh fuck i love i love parks and rec so much i know it's habitat the best. has no keepers assigned to it okay this is a keeper thing so let me go to staff uh, I should probably make this like another a new work zone. Mm -hmm. Oh god, this yeah, this is absolutely <gasps> disastrous. This is, not, this is not good. This is not good. Um, if I can make it all of this. Oh, is this too big? Yeah. They don't How like big that. can the work zone be? I don't think it can. I don't think it can stretch the entire zoo. No, is it because? It is like it that. like? Is it set because uh, one person can only go so far, or how does it yeah. break up? Maybe, I think it, okay. it's so that you don't have one staff member trying to do like all of this. Right, so right. So it's why in this work zone and another. Okay. So maybe I just make all these in one work zone. Work zone two. Okay. Then I'm going to hire another keeper. Okay. Because the hire... families get their own keeper. Oh, yeah. Um, hire the guests. Are they happy? Are they annoyed? What's... Let's find out. Uh, so our They're probably is... going to be annoyed, right? Oh, we have got quite a lot of things coming, though. Let's have a look. Let's see what they think. I wish I could have stayed longer. There's not a oh. lot to do here. Okay. Yeah, well, that's true. <laughs> Can't Education. really argue with that. So uh, it's saying here that they're not, they don't really know what they're seeing, which is fair enough. Oh, okay. So let's try and educate them a bit about what's around here. Um, uh, information, here we go. Um, so there should be... Here we go, viewing devices and speakers. So what you can do... Oh. Is you can Speakers. place down, oh. yeah, you can place down little like information boards about what they're seeing. That's um, cute. So if I put this next not, to the donation not, box, we're not not in the crocodile enclosure. We don't need to educate the crocodiles <laughs> about what's happening here. Come on. Okay, here we go. They um, know what they are. They know what they are. If I put this here, then you can assign it to the uh, saltwater crocodile, and then basically visitors can come up and be like, oh. I'm oh, being educated that. on this thing. Oh, that's cool. The sign actually does have the info on yeah, it. Yeah, which is awesome. So, because yeah. these idiots aren't moving down the actual path, I'm also <laughs> going to put one here. I love the disdain that you have for our guests. Stupid <laughs> idiots. It's like, honestly, unbelievable. This is why I just like visitors are bitches, because they're just they're so <laughs> stupid. OK, 
Okay, let's make this move so we can put our sign there down. We go. So now they're being educated about them. Excellent. I feel like maybe learn can... things. Learn things. Maybe I can put down some. Um... Oh, we should also hire a custodian as well to uh, take care of the place because visitors mm. are going to leave some mess. Oh yes. Panic vet caretaker. Here we go. Nice. Do we need like bins and oh, stuff? I hired two by mistake. That's fine. Ah. Yes, we do. Uh, let me assign this one to. Do you have a work zone? There we go. You can be in work zone two, and you can be in work zone one. There we go. Current salary. They're, they're okay. You know, they're We're pretty, pretty happy. In a good mood. Pretty good. Okay. Yeah. So our money is going up, which is good. So oh, I feel excellent. Like our donation boxes are working. Um, the thing is, not a lot of the guests are going to know. over there. Yeah, exactly. So I might. See if I can put down some signs to be like, go yeah. around here. Yeah, no one's visiting our flamingos. No one's visiting them. Okay, where's, like, go over here. Idiots. Screens and cameras. Maybe some paths. <laughs> I have m intense disdain for my... You really do. You're like, <laughs> idiots. Well, they are <laughs> idiots. <laughs> you realize that this means that whenever we, if we do end up going to a zoo for like a Eurogamer members video, I'm going to have to make sure that I am not being an idiot. Oh my gosh, you I know? so want to do that. I really, so really want to do, do that. that. I feel like it would just be an entire video of just us, like... Idiots. Idiots. Okay, so at least they are going down here now. Um, our money is <laughs> going down though, so I feel like we need some more sources of revenue why aren't they coming up here? yeah you guys are all clumping up here you need to like start moving around so you the, need to keep moving they're the starting windows. to they're starting to move a Very little slowly. bit slowly let me put in uh some educational boards about these flamingos just so they know what they're doing okay. flamingo down this way guys please hey, do you think if you had a a zoo you'd be filling it with puns all the time yeah yeah totally it'd, it'd be, be a missed thing. opportunity if not exactly um, I feel like it should be under signs or something. I definitely, when I was fiddling around before, I definitely saw something that was like signs. Yeah, there. Is that? That's screens and cameras rather than oh, like habitat board. Here. Maybe in construction? Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Okay. Signs. There we go. Oh, cute. Right. Where's... Chief beef. Chief what? beef. Okay, there's not a oh. sign for flamingos. Let me see if it can filter it by. They're so cute. Property? No, that's not it. Uh, maybe not. Standing signs or let's do standing signs. Oh, okay. Planet Zoo sign educational, editable. Um, a post. Editable. Maybe a post would be a good idea. Yeah. Oh, just they have to peer down quite a bit to get to it, but you know, it's uh, probably okay. okay. They're starting me... to move, starting to disperse. Yeah, yeah, that's a good place to put one. Oh. Oop. Well, why are you not like this? Not like this. Not like this. Like, okay. there, there you go. There you go. Right. Let me just rotate this. Ooh. Okay. I don't know why that. That just. I was like, whoo! You can rotate it wherever you want. Flamingos. This. Hang on. This. <laughs> no way you can write no whatever way. you want on there. That's yes. so good. There we go. <laughs> Done. Done. Zoe! Oh no, it didn't save it! Does it not let me type idiots? Flamingos. Okay, maybe that'll work. Done? Is that the, f the way to flamingos? Is this the way to the flamingos? Uh, yes. Oh, it is, yeah. yes. Okay. okay, good. They are actually moving now, which is good as well. Nice. Okay, uh, so we've got some loos here. This is good. What are these trying to tell me? Feeding zone cannot be reached by keepers. Oh yeah, okay, that's probably a big deal. The feed keepers can't actually get to the feeding zone over here. Whoopsie. Which is, you know, fair enough. So I'm just gonna add another uh what barriers, right? I'm just gonna add there we go. What's your and favorite animal? Gates. Um I like dogs a lot. But yeah. I also really like Komodo dragons. Because I'm Ooh. I'm that bitch. <laughs> you are certainly that bitch. Um, it's just like they're so. I just find them fascinating. Like their venom is poisonous, mm -hmm. which is incredible. Um, and they can like paralyze things just using their venom. Yeah, they're quite I scary, aren't they? Really, I love them so much. There we go. Okay, now you can access the feeding trough. You absolutely unbelievable. <laughs> Cannot believe it. You can't get the help these they're days. So fussy. So fussy. 
Yeah, like okay. what you you want a door? Yeah, what? really? Who do you think you Come are? Come on, who do you think you are? Okay, this is good. We're getting more money, so we should build. We some pay you to solve these problems. Yeah, come on. Right, I feel like they're getting distracted by the crocodiles. Maybe if they knew that stuff was further up here, then they'd be walking around. Yeah, what? But like, but like the pa I mean, do they think what they really think they came here just to see one singular crocodile? What do you mean habitat has no thingy assigned? This habitat does have a thing. Oh, okay. I have no <laughs> keepers assigned. Oops. Keeper cannot reach habitat. Well, the keeper's a liar, because they can absolutely reach the habitat. Right. Oh my god. I'm gonna pause this. This is this is me in if I manage my own. Place. Yeah, you're gonna be a terrifying like, boss. Like seriously. <laughs> okay. Keeper hut keeper hut's there instead, and I'll just delete all these paths. The thing I really like about Planet Zoo is that it's so easy to delete paths. You just right click and they're gone. It's no like that is lovely. It's not yeah. faffing around or anything. I think like yeah, most most of the time with games like these, it's that fiddliness that kind of puts me off. Exactly. And like yeah. like clicking stuff together, and making it work. Whereas the, this seems to cut a lot of that out. So I'm like yeah, totally up yeah. for that. Okay, work zone one doesn't have any energy, <laughs> so we should probably put in a generator. Does this not supply the whole thing? Let me look. Oh. Okay, so yeah, you can see yeah. like you can see where the generators power things. So it's doing fine. It's doing okay. Um I'm just gonna... e EA122's done a super chat. Uh Attenborough voice. Here we see idiots on the wooden walkways. <laughs> they are a source of nuisance for Zoe, but needed for the financial upkeep of the zoo. Yeah. Who's whose idea was it to have visitors in the zoo? Who came up <laughs> with that idea? Okay. Crazy. Shall we like introduce another creature to our roster yes who should we let's introduce do it. uh we've got some flamingos we've got some yeah. crocodiles what do we need feeling? more than one crocodile do you think uh, the crocodiles are quite expensive that's my only thing oh, okay. we're currently losing money so, oh right oh really okay yeah. um maybe... well these are all boring i know maybe we could have some some lemurs yeah They're the red cheap. roughed lemurs actually look yeah. quite fun and that adds a bit of verticality as well because exactly. we're going to need them to, for things to climb on. Okay, now these need at least 20 meters of climbing Oh stuff. my god, you scared the life out of me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, Seb's just handed me some coffee because he's lovely. Thank you. Okay. And I just like... <gasps> <gasps> okay, how much money are we losing? No, not that much. It's okay. Frank, what are you talking about? Frank's like, today we learned Aoife can't do Attenborough. That was a flawless... That I... was a flawless Attenborough I impersonation. beg your pardon? I'm sorry. <laughs> What are you talking about? I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> uh, maybe we could build the Lima place like here. The thing is, they mm -hmm. don't—they don't need any grass, so I feel like we shouldn't build it in the bit with with like water and stuff. But yes, it's probably fine. Okay, yes. Let's build this. One oh, quackers! Quackers are so cute. Oh, they're adorable. Absolutely adorable. They're so smiley. They they're are. So happy. I saw a really good tweet the other day that was like quokkas are basically that jolly um, guard that like uh, from medieval films that uh, yes. is taking care of the supply of you know meat or something. Yes, absolutely. That's what they are. Oh, they're so cute. I love them so much. Okay. Um, so I want to build these paths here. So I figure we could have like our little enclosure here and then yes. people can see and then we can kind of save this bit in case you want an enclosure here as well. Yes, so. it looks good. I quite like the layout of this, you know, with the, like, yeah. the lots of, I like lots of water, lots of trees. We should probably try and make it into like a circle at some point, but that's a problem, yes, that's a problem for future us, not for now. It's fine. Yeah, it's okay. Um, so, because these will need to be quite tall, what we can do, which is really cool, is we can turn them into like glass. So, oh, yes. you'll actually be able to see, let's make these a bit yes. smaller. You can see through the fences, so... It doesn't matter that they're kind of going to obstruct the... Oh, nah. Okay, now what I do need to do, which I forgot to do when I was practicing, I need to make sure they're anti-climb fences. Oh, right, yeah. Lemurs are uh, pretty pretty agile. They, they like climbing. Front. And uh, I forgot that when I was building enclosures for bonobos and chimps, and they escaped <laughs> at least six times. <laughs> oh, but what? This game's no fun if you don't at least experience at least one uh, escaped animal. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, I've got on pause at the moment. I should keep going. Um, okay. uh, so everyone's asking, this is this PC only? I, I believe so, right? Yes, I think so. I don't think yeah. it's on. Um, 
I don't think it's on console. The thing is, on P- you need to be able to do so many different things. Like That's true. So I don't know how it would work on console, to be honest. It would be a bit of a nightmare, yeah, to have... Yeah. Um, I think you need a mouse and keyboard. Yeah, exactly. Uh, it's from, kind of, um, it reminds me of a lot of playing The Sims. Yeah, well, you know? yeah, it is very Sim-like. Yeah, okay. definitely. Okay. Um, One more. Uh, David DT is in a super chat saying, I request manatees. Super manatees. cute and my spirit animal. Oh. <laughs> okay. Do you ever see that video of a manatee? Like, it's just like, it just, it doesn't see that there's a glass plating yes. in front of it. And it just oh. goes, womp. Oh, God. <laughs> the it's biggest so squidge. <laughs> it's adorable. Okay. Um, climb proof. Okay. Hang on. No, wait a second. I am going to remember. I'm going to make the whole thing climb proof. Yes. God damn it. Smart. Okay. Um, Fail in the wild, the wild Elf says, fun fact, there is a place here in Britain which is not allowed to be called a zoo because it only contains animals rescue, rescued from zoos and neglected owners. That's they amazing. have to call They have to call it an animalarium. Animalarium. Oh my god. <laughs> Doesn't exactly roll off the tongue, but what a wonderful... Um, That's incredible. What a wonderful thing to do. So yeah, we've made all of this into glass now so people can still see through even when they come down these things. Um, mm. But we also need somewhere for the keepers. So yes. The keepers... You said earlier we needed a staff room as yes, well, right? Yes, we do. We've already got one staff room over here, which is mm. actually quite far away here. <laughs> um, Simon Simon Vin says, magpies are my most feared animal as a Aussie. Have you ever heard of swooping season? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Don't it's pretty, like it. Pretty, uh, Don't like pretty it. Pretty terrifying. And like, my um, uncle has like a chunk out of his skull because he was swooped by a seagull when <gasps> he was delivering mail. Now oh that's my is gosh. that not terrifying? That really is. But gulls are horrifying. scary. Yeah, they will they will mess you up if they think you're threatening their um, babies. Those oh big boy. guys you get in Brighton, like they have no fear. They, they will come straight for care. you. Come on, why aren't you hooking up? Come on, hook. Oh god, hook up, hook up. Okay, you're not you're not helping me really. Okay, there we go. <laughs> um, so I think terrain too uneven for placement. Come on. Gosh darn it. There we go. Down. Honestly, the de- the when I figured out that you could do this, I it blew my mind. Blew my <gasps> mind. Ooh. We're losing quite a lot of money, but that's fine because we're building something. Yeah, it can't be. Uh, it can't be cheap to make all these yeah. elevated walkways, right? No, probably not. Uh, but I have absolutely no knowledge of i'm not very good at making things like cost effective when i'm building i'm just like eh, <laughs> it'll be fine i can probably make it work oh crusty jogger juggler sorry uk says a magpie took my brother's glasses right off his face oh my god oh my god that's terrifying yeah kind of funny but yeah quite kind, scary kind of funny, but also scary what did it want glasses for is it because they were shiny maybe oh yeah i guess so how are we going to make these link up? Uh, Quixon Quincy, sorry if I'm saying that uh, incorrectly, it says, can I assume that Eurogamer spared no expense building this park? Amazing. And Frontier did do uh, Jurassic World Evolution? Yeah. Jurassic Park? Come on, yeah, the, the, it's basically this, but but dinosaurs. Incredible. Amazing. Yeah. Okay, come on. Down, go down to this. Look, it's, just, it's here. Look, a yummy path for you to connect to. Mm. <laughs> oh god this is an absolute mess this. <laughs> oh boy okay it's fine terrain to uneven placement right i'm gonna try and level this stuff out then uh this i don't know where this is going i don't know what's happening here i'm just gonna leave that um, yeah. terrain let's make this go <laughs> up 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 Yes, that's quite of, a it's quite a fun tool. Yeah, that looks all right. Kind of working, kind of leveling it up a little bit. Um, oh, thank man. you for the super chat, Alan Fraser. Alan Fraser says, "What happened to the Zifa playthrough of The Last of Us Two? I was enjoying that series. I mean, we might go back to it. It's just that there's a lot of stuff happening at the moment. Yes, um, yeah, there is only and only so so much you know time we have to make." tons of different things and also we don't want to be too let's play heavy yeah um and obviously the more streams we do a week the less time we have to make edited videos so exactly. it's just finding that little bit of a balancing act um because you know if we're doing 
like Final Fantasy VII, and we're doing uh, you know Dark Souls Two, and and obviously trying out new games like Surgeon Sim and things like that. Yeah. Um, it's just about finding the time. It but is, um, it's about finding that balance, just like you said. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Yeah. Because yeah, we we do want to do some more uh, you know fun stuff as well. We don't yeah. want to be too tied down with too many series going on series-es-es. at the same time. Yeah. Okay, I need to find a different way for keepers to get into here because this is too uneven for me to work with right now. So. Get rid of all this stuff. <gasps> oh my gosh. Sarah, Sarah says, my brother got a magpie embedded in <gasps> his head once when we were kids. What? It swooped him. It swooped him when he wasn't wearing a helmet, pulled it out and chucked it away. Oh my gosh. Holy shit. I hope your brother was okay. That is terrifying. They're such bullies. Oh god. That gen- that terrifies me. That is very yeah. scary. Let's do this. Oh, Rue's Garden Guide says, I know you guys are saving animals here, but I was thinking about tavern time. And if you had a special made cocktail just for you, what would it include? <gasps> well, Ooh. in a members video that we made, yeah. we did uh, go into like our own custom cocktails. To be fair, that was kind of like a themed around a game though. If you, oh, if you were going to have, yeah, if you were going to have, because I know oh. you love tequila. Would you have a tequila based cocktail or would you have something else? It would have to be something that sounds vaguely like medievally or nighty. So I like okay. mead, but um, my fate one. I don't know fate... how you would put mead in a cocktail. <sighs> Me neither. It would just be mead, wouldn't it? I'm sure there yeah. are ways you've done it. One of my favorite cocktails is called Yuso Saki, and it's oh, basically yes. plum wine and sake and like some flavored bitters, and it is amazing. That sounds delicious. Yeah, it's fantastic. Okay, so this is our Lima place. Mm-hmm. Which is good. That looks good. Yeah. Looks really good. Uh, we need to put some climbing stuff in it at the moment. So Yeah. Yeah, they need some fun. Um I would I would definitely go for a whiskey based cocktail. Yeah. Although you saying um umeshu as an ingredient has made me like quite excited. That's yeah. plum wine. Um plum and wine I love umeshu. It's incredible. Absolutely. So incredible. good. Okay, people seem to like the place so far. We're gradually getting more money. What? David Whitfield says you get fined if you defend yourself against magpie attacks. What? what? That can't be right. Really? That would that would only make sense to me if they were endangered, and it doesn't seem like they are. Oh my god. So what? You just gotta let them maul you, that, effectively. Please please explain that, because I'm fascinated. Um, <laughs> Simon Vin says, yeah, people are always saying Aussie's animals are terrifying and deadly, but they never think of magpies being that animal. <laughs> Well, yeah, because Australia does have the world's most, uh, world's deadliest snakes and spiders. Yeah. Um, which, it does. Yeah. Okay, let's. Yeah. Oh, and no, sec- no security guards to deal with crime. Oh, man. Okay, we should probably hire some then. Crime? Oh, like pickpocketing? I didn't stuff? think of crime being a thing. Okay, no. Hire security. Here you go. Let's put them where all the things are. There we go. Oh, I'm actually yeah, loving how many Aussies are in the chat right yay! now. Yay! <laughs> M1, and I'm gonna... Jack escaped the box again, says, don't forget to educate the morons. I mean, patrons. <laughs> they are morons. Absolute morons. Okay, this is this is zone one. Oh, yeah. Apparently magpies are a protected species. Oh, really? Jeez. Well, if they're going to be dicks about it, like... Well, if you're going to be like a dick about game. it... <laughs> Okay, come on. I want maybe they need to stop having thing. notions. Like, if they want to be protected or whatever, maybe, you know, stop yeah. picking fights with people. Just stop it. Just stop. Okay, this is work zone two. Cool. So, let me just make sure they've all got work zone one, work zone one, work zone one, vendors, work zone two. You're just wandering around. you got nothing to do. And a vet, <laughs> you can be in work zone why is Brett Littlejohn unhappy? Uh, Brett, why, chill out. You've why only just started. Unhappy? They've literally only just I mean, started their like, job. What do you have to complain about at the moment? Where are you? That's you, right? You've been bringing that energy on your first day, Brett. Stuff needs. Everything is all right, I suppose. Well, Brett, you've been here five minutes. Maybe wait a while before you pass judgment. What do you mean the vet cannot reach? There's gate. I've got the right just here. Getting, we're just getting arsy with everybody. It's what the hell everyone do you mean? Oh, I'm I'm not. One of the habitat 2's walls got damaged. 
Okay. Oh, Max Barr says, I marry my Australian on Saturday. I love this country oh, so much. Oh, incredible. Congratulations. Congrats. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, I hope you guys have an amazing day. Okay, maybe we should hire a mechanic to fix things. Yeah? Yeah. Because they're complaining about, what's this, high workload. Oh, okay. The Mashes says, yeah, early streams bring out the Aussies, so we just accidentally happened to set the stream at the right time for our Aussie pals. <laughs> yeah, and what do you mean accidentally? Completely intentional, I think. Oh, yeah, 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 totally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're hungry. Why are you hungry? Jake Franklin says, when I was growing up in Darwin, we were always told we could use an empty ice cream container as a backup magpie helmet if needed. Oh, my God. A backup magpie helmet. My God. They, they are aggressive. Has moderate issues. Okay, you're assigned to this one though, right? I think energy just means how much energy the thingy has. What? I think energy means how much energy the staff has. Like him personally, as in like within his body, yeah. or energy as in within, electricity outlets? He I needs like, like a charge of his phone. Within his body, it's how much oh. energy he has. Okay. Okay, so if you could... Let your body be your generator. Inspecting Habitat 4. Could you like fix this? Cool, keep it to habitat. Oh, oh, okay. Our gorgeous flamingo couple are having a little swim together. Ah, food quality must be set on the habitat gate. Okay. Let's have a look at this. Cleanliness, terrain, range, animals. Grade one food quality. Cool. I think. Level, level 99 red chocobo says, speaking of the world's deadliest snakes, we had some baby dugites in the backyard one year only discovered them because the cat managed to catch one and started playing with it i'm gonna need to gonna need to google that oh my god okay we should probably give these leaves <gasps> something to do look at them they're just stuck in this giant oh, enclosure oh, with no. nothing okay uh habitat first of all let's give them oh my gosh habitat. a dugite is a species of venomous potentially lethal snake native to western australia oh god please tell me your cat was okay terrifying they're so unassuming looking. It's like, picture a snake. It's just, there's Ooh. no, it's just a brown snake. Okay. Oh my you God. Want some toys They're quite and scary. food. That's terrifying. That's yeah. actually terrifying. In your backyard. <laughs> okay, lemurs. Uh, what are you? You're a red roughed lemur. Okay. Red roughed lemur. Okay, cool. It's Apparently. Oh, sorry, go ahead. No, no, you go ahead. I'm just trying to make sure. I was just going to okay. say that apparently people also cover their helmets in spikes like cable ties and such to ward oh, away shit. magpies. Wow. That's, That's terrifying. That is genuinely terrifying. <laughs> it's just like, wow. it's the, it reminds you that like we are, we like to think we're the top predator, but seriously, we are like, no. we need to work on it. Also, how boring our wildlife is in comparison to Australia. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Oh god. Um, I know I'm happy having boring wildlife. It means I'm not swooped. That's you true. Know, or like you have to check your toilet for spiders exactly. or whatever. Which I don't know if that's actually true, but um Jack Escaped the Box again says that the uh flashbacks to theme hospital late to the party, which is so true. That was that was uh quite aggressive also, where we're just like blaming everybody else for our problems. <laughs> because it's not our fault at all. <laughs> no, of course it's not. Why would it be our fault? Exactly. Um the thing is like with I feel like you have more reason to get angry at Theme Park Hospital because, like, the focus is the patients, whereas in this, yeah. you're supposed to just be taking care of things. Yeah. You know? but Look at how there's nobody down at the end of the park. Come on, you guys need to, you know, you guys need to work on this. Come on. <laughs> I've put in some ferns and everything. Look, Come yeah, on. look, they're literally between two ferns. Look at the little lemur. Okay. Oh my like god. Tropical. Uh, I'm just gonna have to give you some stuff that isn't that, because that's... Do you not want some trees or anything? Pumera flowers? They, they, they've got to want some trees. All these look really small, though. That's This is my thing. I feel like they should want more than this. You know? Is this apparently all they want? Well... No. Coverage. Bird's nest fern. Okay, maybe you do want stuff in Asia. Asia and Africa. Okay. I'm just gonna start putting some of these around and hopefully they'll like it. There yeah. we go. There we go. I want some like big, although I guess maybe I shouldn't put trees in here because they might climb them. Like maybe I should get rid of this poplar. If you keep it far enough away from the fence, yeah, maybe move that yeah. uh, a little bit further Straight in. Straight up, get rid of it. Uh, put some more around here. We do, we do not have a lot of money left, so we might have to pause it for a bit while the 
Okay. I'm pause it. <laughs> How are you doing? You like this? Moderate quality. Okay. Enrichment. Okay. Well, they want some more plants, so I guess. Come on, put some here and some elephant ear plants as well. Come on, so close. So close. Okay, so ten percent. So the bare minimum, but they're happy, so it's okay. Okay, there we go. Right. Okay, seriously, you guys need to like keep. You need to keep moving. You need to start moving like up they're, here and stuff. They're super fascinated by that one. Super that one croc. Uh, what do you What do you mean you can't reach it? There's look. It's here. You can get in right here. You stupid idiots. Has the doing? path not connected up or something? No, like it's all connected. Cannot reach habitat. Is it because... <laughs> is it because this is like blocked in? Maybe? Maybe. Maybe I'm going to move this bit up. Uh, the Mashes says, Scary Aussie snake story. My grandmother came home from mass one Sunday with five kids, opened the door, and on the back porch was a big mama brown snake and about a dozen babies that had hatched. <gasps> Oh, no thank you. Absolutely no, no. thank you. Uh, Varian Krogan says, We found a tiger snake in my brother's room once when my nana was babysitting us. The most traumatic part of the experience was having to watch home and away with her whilst we waited for the snake man. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Which, I guess this is a new thing. Like I've just learned that Australia has snake men to come and deal with your snakes. Which snake men, oh, God. I guess that is like a specialised profession. Yeah. Uh, um, Monica says they might not be assigned to the work zone, which is why they can't come there. Okay, I need some more adults here as well. Um, let me have a look. I'm just going to change the quality to grade 2 for quality to make them a little bit happier. Um, and we need to adopt an extra flamingo because they're not happy with just having one of them. Oh. Let's give them another flamingo. There we go. Do we have enough? Yeah, just about. There we go. Let me see. Um... But the thing is, you know, I, I obviously want to make sure they're okay, but yeah. also I don't care enough. I want to make sure the animals are okay. <laughs> Lloyd Maeve did a slipper chat saying, everyone at the zoo has an electricity charge level. Westworld crossover confirmed. Exactly. Uh, okay. Right. Our money's going down, which isn't great. No. But still. We need more, we need more I, stuff. I don't think we're going to complete all these in time somehow. No, God, how maybe quick, not. How quick must you have to do it to get all of this stuff done? Yeah, I know. And no. to make enough money. Oh my God. Oof. Okay. We need some more guests. That's what we need. We um, might need more animals too. Yeah, I think we've got three types of animals so far. We've got some blues. Mm -hmm. Maybe we should put like a shop here or something because he's guests yeah. are not smart yeah we need more revenue exactly That's... uh oh god there's a lot that we can't afford we only have 500 pounds so maybe <sighs> guess we're oh no Can we not afford like a a uh thingy machine a vending machine guess, or anything? yeah guess thoughts i wish i could have stayed longer to see the greater flamingo i mean it was only 100 yards down the walkway yeah, so i far don't away i don't know what's stopping you what oh, yeah Manage your time better, guest. Yeah, this is on. not our problem. Yeah, you should just just keep walking. Don't get don't get all like obsessed with the amazing crocodile that we have. Like just move yeah. move around. Yeah, they really do love the croc. Maybe we need more like we need more more of them are coming up here, which is good. You know? We could extend the path beyond the crocodile and kind of try and make it more circular so that people Oh yeah, maybe we could loop come it around, around here. a bit more. That's a good idea. Okay, let's try to do that. Uh let me see. Maybe. Nightcat says, yeah, stick cafes and other stuff along the path. It'll bring money and encourage people to walk along. Yeah, that's a good point. Why are they so stupid, though? Why don't they see, like, path and be like, man, maybe I should go this maybe way. Maybe I should go here. Because they're idiots. <laughs> stupid idiots. 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 Okay. Uh, this is fine. I feel like we can just... Okay. Right. We need to do some editing to these barriers. Where are our flamingos? There's one over there, one there, and should be a third one too. Okay, I just want to make sure oh, I don't yeah. build a barrier that ends up like cutting them off. Exactly. Yeah. There's two on that uh, hexagonal feeding station, and there's one in the yeah. water on I'm the gonna, other side. I'm gonna. Okay, I need to delete this one. Oh. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. It's okay. 
Uh, they're gonna get away. No, they'll be they'll be fine. Like, oh, that would cut that one off. <gasps> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh. Hang on. I need to think about this. <laughs> so this is gonna come over here. Um. Codex versus the world says when I heard about quokkas, I googled and I accidentally googled cloacas. <laughs> I haven't been the same since. Oh God. Do I even want to ask That's a what hell that of is? a mistake. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna delete these and just carry on building my path. And then hopefully, maybe I'll think of a solution if I just do this. <laughs> oh, okay. Maybe it can go underneath the path. Can't it? Do you guys, do you guys not want to? Oh my gosh! <laughs> Figure it out. Beep. Oh, Oof. come on. Beep. You're being friends, but you're not being like. Come on. Okay. Terrain. <laughs> David DT says all this talk of scary animals the UK is like a seagull stole my ice cream once <laughs> so true uh, yeah we, we don't have really, nothing we don't really have scary animals there we go okay now you're happy sweet yeah this is fine and then I can just uh need to link up the path can yeah. the path go underneath the walkway um let's find out I feel like it should yeah there you go no it's it's getting oh is it not it's being fussy yeah there it's obstructed okay. Ugh. Ugh. Shut up. Can you make it lower? Yeah, maybe I can. Uh, let me just... Maybe if I put this here... <laughs> Wogle says, I can genuinely imagine Zoe watching all these people on the CCTV and repeatedly getting <laughs> on the park intercom to shout at the idiot guests to tell them where to go. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> you, there, in the yellow shirt, keep moving, I see you. Oh, no, you idiot. Idiot. Um, right, the problem is this bit here. What I need is, yeah, this isn't gonna work. Maybe if I make, okay, 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 this is fine, this is fine. Oh boy. Okay. And Pan says, Straya represent. Yes. Oh, indeed. Okay, more, more around here. Is that where you want to go? You don't want to go under here, do you? You stupid. I will fence. not have a fence bully us around look you know what if the flamingos get past this then i applaud their ingenuity oh they deserve they deserve it they, they deserve to escape start a new life elsewhere okay there we go okay you that's happy nice now? yeah happy that's now? good right so we've got this thing going here so um we should build some facilities then we yes save up some money first Quino G42 says they live in Arizona. Once had a bark scorpion fall off my ceiling onto my bed. No, no thank, thank you. you. No, ma'am. Don't want it. Oh, Don't need it. Oh. Mm -mm. oh, do we need to? Do we need to build? Is this the end? Ah, uh, there we go. Okay, maybe that's why people were getting fussy. Yeah. Okay. Cool. What? So we, we, had, we had an entrance going in here. We yeah. didn't have one going into this entrance as well. Oh, I see. So people might be getting a bit annoyed. What is that? What is that place? Uh, these are toilets. Oh, okay, gotcha. So what we want now Fair is enough. to put. Maybe I should just. <laughs> it's like all the all like the one toilet has the people just walking under, and then the other one has people leaping over the fence yeah. to try and get in there. Right. Let's put this gift shop like here, so they have to walk past it. You know. Yeah. Definitely. Okay. Uh, like here. Do you want it here? Oh, you want it here. Sure, and that doesn't really let you. Maybe here. Whoop. Yeah. Whoop. There. there we go. Because you're clearly idiots, so. You need to. I don't know why you're out of your post, but you need to get moving. It's <laughs> not where you belong. Where do you work? Works in two. Work. Looney Bloons one. Okay, so she's heading back to where she works. Okay, um, good. Um. Okay, they're starting to spread out a bit more. Yeah, a bit, and we are slowly getting more money. Are the lemurs okay? Uh, the lemurs are... Importantly, they're not escaped, and that's Okay, that's I good. About. Oh, look at them. Oh, oh, oh. Look, look at they're so lemurs. majestic! Oh, God, I love oh. them. Okay. Are they happy? Let's have a look. Their meal wasn't good quality, so... I'm just gonna, Aww. I can change that here. If I go to the grade one, I can change it to grade two food quality, which means okay, good. it's better quality. So uh, I'm gonna speed things up and then okay. oh, see <gasps> our money, like, it's kind of, why is our money? It's going up and down, up and down, up and down, but it's fine. Can't, Can't find, find an, 
Why? Okay, Why fine. must we deal with these uh, idiots? These fools. Okay, let me build a staff room then. Uh, where's our staff room? Here we go. Oh, no, we can't because everything's too expensive. Okay. <laughs> Let's keep going then. Whee! Okay, I feel like our priority should be building... Uh... Oh, why are your clumps up? Oh, diseased animal discovered. <gasps> no! No! Oh, no. Monkey pox? I didn't know monkey pox was a thing. Where did they get that from? There's only two of them. I think they can like spontaneously develop it if their food isn't good enough, but I just increased their food. Stupid, this is the keeper's fault then. Okay, maybe we should build a quarantine, but we don't have enough money. Okay, we need to keep, we need to keep going. I feel like this is just gonna cause disease everywhere, mm -hmm. but it's, it's mainly okay, it's mainly okay. Oh, yep, look, okay, they're taking them, they're taking them somewhere. Where are you okay. taking them? Where are they going? Don't, I hope they don't take them out the back to deal with the problem like we know do we oh do we need like a medical facility in yeah, the park i think we might uh right but we still can't afford anything no. i might just i might build some more places for people to buy things a vending okay. machine what can we build that would make the vending machine might work yeah these are all shells uh, or a donation finance. box. Donation yeah. boxes are pretty cheap. Let's put a donation box. Like, there's one there, so they should be reminded to donate. Okay. Let's put, and there's one there. Okay, so why aren't they donating, you why? cheapskates? Okay, let me move this so it's to the side. <laughs> and... Zombie lemurs incoming. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> uh, and I think I might build maybe. Merchandise? Yes. So these are just shells. These aren't actually shops. Just selling oh, t-shirts with like monkey pox. <laughs> I got monkey pox at this thing. <laughs> uh, so entrance information. Okay, let's... Maybe building a vending machine will help. You want to buy some stuff, right? There you go. Yeah, get some get some delicious drinks and snacks. Exactly. And you can just... What better way to compliment your visit to the park than to... Oh, look, well, they are they are buying them. Jesus. Yeah. Um, EA122 says, So the stream thus far, start with the zoo, end up with a potential pandemic on our hands, on brand for 2020. Yeah, I see yep. no issue with what you're outlining right here. I think everything's <laughs> fine. Um, well, we have $200. Yay! So why is no one going to the Looney Bloon shop? Yeah, nobody's what, look, nobody's this is amazing. interested. Why why aren't you interested in this? Cuz they're stupid and lazy. What? Don't want to walk down them steps. Go go get balloons. Has it lit why Why aren't they like why nobody aren't is coming anything? by? No one's bought anything. Oh my god, it's actually like losing money. Yeah, how? How? High amount of litter. Is I thought we I why How are we paying you? our caretakers money? Why are why aren't you buying stuff here? You stupid <sighs> guests. Worst. Okay, I don't care. I'm just gonna keep playing. We are losing money. Oh god, we're losing quite a lot of money. No. Oh god. Okay, right. I think the best thing to do would maybe be to I don't know, build some more stuff. Thing is we need to buy build merch so that people can buy things, but we don't have any money! Oh, what Chief can we beef. do? What's the best way to generate income quickly? Uh, I guess we could... Oh my god. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. Look, oh we're no. minus $50. What is taking oh so much no. money? Cash flow. Oh dear. Oh dear. Construction was quite uh, expensive. No. Staff wages are very expensive. Well. Maybe I should fire some people. <laughs> Oh god. Oh, oh good no, god. I'm making redundancies happen. Uh, no. You're idle, uh, first of all, so. Um, Sarah's done a super chat I'm saying, my you. fave childhood animal memory. Find a bird eating spider in my pool, caught it oh. for show and tell at school. I pinned it out and still have it. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. Okay, you're going to get fired as well. I don't need you. That's a bird eating spider. That's got to be a big, a big thing. Yeah. Pretty badass. Oh, bird eating spider. Okay, I fired two people, so maybe we'll start to make some more money now. Shift shift says hire a salesman. Yeah. We have a vendor, you know. Yeah. 
Come on, just spend money. That should be on the sign here. Spend money, idiots. <laughs> oh, we are losing a lot of money. Yikes. Okay. There's, there, I mean, there's plenty of visitors. Why are they not... Just donate. Just donate. Yeah. If I click on this, I think I can see how much. Sort of species people <sighs> really nothing. like the flamingos. Oh. Okay. Uh, did I put any donation boxes here? I didn't. <laughs> Spoon of Doom says, and so quickly Zoe slips to the dark side of <laughs> capitalism. <laughs> exactly. I fail to see what you're pointing out here. I mean, this is a great place. And if those idiots can't see this is a great place to be, then I don't even care. Okay, let's put... I can't, I can't afford anything, so I have to just wait for them to make money. Oh no! Oh dear! Oh, we've we've not done well oh, at this. Oh dear, we have not. Well, you know, Eurogamer aren't known for being uh, immediately. We're incredible. slow burns here. We're slow burns, We're slow burns indeed, here. We Should we put down more donation boxes? Would that help? The thing is, I can't afford to buy them because I have oh minus. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> Minus eight at uh, that seven hundred pounds. Oh god! What? Oh no! Oh, oh we're god. losing so we're much losing money. Losing loads of money. Okay, right. we're there. What? We're going up. We're going, we're going up. up. We keep going up and down, up and down. Oh. Oh no! Oh no! What can we do when we get our uh, habitat cleanliness is a disease risk? Well, we're hiring tons <laughs> we're of cleaners. So what are they? What are which, they doing? Which habitat? Which habitat is a disease risk? Is it this? <laughs> Is this a disease risk? I don't know. Barrier status. Okay, let's let's call the mechanic to here. Listen, let's if our animals are happy number. and looked after, I'm going to still call it a win. Yeah. Although the cleanliness is like, we only have like a handful of animals. I don't exactly. know why all these guys litter. are doing with their time. Okay. Well... <sighs> We're sl kind of making more money. Yeah, kind of. It's going up. What are major says? Taxes. We've been we've been taxed sixteen dollars. Oh my gosh! Sorry, I had to. Sorry, I said uh, to Google bird eating spiders to see how big they are because because they were really dumb as a kid, and I cannot believe that you did that. Zoe, you don't want to know how big these spiders are. Bird eating spiders. Yeah. Are they smaller or bigger than my hand? Bigger than your hand. Shit. By by a considerable margin. How big are they? They are chunky boys. Oh my gosh. How big are they though? They're they're huge. <laughs> they're like the size of, like I think with the legs and all about the size of a dinner plate. <gasps> I had no yep. idea they were that big. I had yep. no idea they were that big. How did you catch that for your show and tell? What? Well, they, sorry, they caught one. Yes. And what? brought it to uh, school for uh, show and tell. Uh, I, am, uh. I am terrified of you. You are terrifying. Does, does Planet Zoo have like um, insect uh, enclosure things? Yeah. Like insect houses? So That's you can cool. have exhibits where you can have like frogs and lizards Aww. and uh, insects and stuff and snails. Yeah. Um, which is pretty good. Okay, we're That's slow. Awesome. We've, got, we've got 500 pounds now, which is good. Yay. I feel like most of our money is coming from these vending machines. Why aren't oh, you going? You can put some more down. Why aren't you going to this place? Okay. Okay, this requires some. I'm just. <laughs> okay, I'll put it there for a second. I'm not going to leave it there. It's not going to stay there. <laughs> I promise. I'm just going to. What's this? Is this the staff room? That's the staff room. Okay. Oh my gosh. Dinner plate size. Make that there. That is. I didn't need to know that. On the list of <sighs> things I didn't need to know today, that was one of them. That's just, imagine just seeing one of those just hanging out in your garden. No, thank you. <laughs> I'm, not into that. I'm not fond of that at all. Like, I wouldn't say I have arachnophobia, but I just, I would, I would rather keep those guys at a distance. Yeah. Like, they I can, don't want to know about you. I want to just, They can yeah. go and do their thing, you know, you, you, they don't, they don't need you to do your thing. Yeah. They can just, they can just leave you be. Yeah, I will leave them be. They leave me be. We're all happy. Like that, we have an accord. It's just it's fine. fine. Yeah, it's just fine. Um, so I want to build this at a higher level, but I can't quite remember how to do that. So instead, I'm just going <laughs> is that to... guy just 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 hovering? Yeah, which guy over here? Oh yeah, I accidentally yeah. deleted that path. I should probably. Whoops. There we go. There we uh, go. <laughs> he's none the wiser. You'd be in trouble. He's none the wiser. I think he'd be like straight in the flamingo. No, actually, he wouldn't be. Exactly. He'd just be... Yeah, he, he, no way to get out. There's no problem with that. Okay, yeah. let's find a way to get him to spend some more money. Maybe we should put in... 
can afford an ATM. I'm just gonna press play and hope they spend some more money. Um, Isabel says, can you put the shop on the walkway? No, so I did, I did just try that. When I clicked it and say move, it doesn't, it won't let me pull it like on an elevated height and I can't oh, figure I see. out, I can't figure out how to make it go higher. Yeah, you'd think you'd be able to raise or lower it. Yeah, maybe I'm not using the right thing. Advanced move rotate? Maybe? What does that do? Ah, uh, here we go. Does that? Yeah, sure. That's, I love it. I like it just being hovering. Oh, wow. Um, I saw a comment from uh, Frank Linertz. It says, I'm not big into spiders, but if I ever take one as a pet, it's going to be a cobalt blue tarantula for sure. Those are beautiful. Incredible. So I Googled it. It is bright blue. R like, like proper blue? Yeah, like the co a color that I didn't think y you just would get with spiders oh ever. They're oh, like really rich blue. They're awesome. Okay, so uh, Looney Bloons is now up don't mm -hmm. worry about Yay. how it's actually suspending itself because that's, <laughs> <laughs> that's fine it's that magic it's that fine doesn't matter it's not important uh let me just test this stuff i have, have a vendor how is that why is that i don't know <laughs> i just said i wanted it higher up and the game was like okay <laughs> if that's what you want okay let me find some i'm gonna fire some staff and hire some oh, staff. oh no uh vendors uh assign vendor to shop you go here Oh, mortal koala says biggest spider i've met in the wild was a huntress it lived in a tent with me at boy scout camp for a week i thought it was a husk until it moved oh no ah! thank you this is a terrifying stream we're just getting details of how so many people who watch this have like literally just i meant it it's so died. interesting okay what facilities without power why oh do i need power here well i thought i had another generator <laughs> me just talking to myself now what what dead zeppelin says it's a balloon store that's why it's floating <laughs> it's like the house and up it's a good idea <laughs> that's exactly what's happening here okay fix that so we can get that have some power please thank you uh we've gone back to losing money so that's great that's great i love that uh and this lean is not doing too great why aren't you doing too great severe Aww. welfare issues where are you uh, they're a bit further along the oh, path, aren't yeah, they? Oh, yeah, they've taken them. Okay. Oh, no! Is that both of them? Uh, is it? Where are you? Oh, that generator doesn't look happy. No, I've called a mechanic to uh, okay. fix it. Mechanic being requested. Where are you going? Low welfare? No. Where are you taking them? Uh, do we have any lemurs left? We have one <laughs> lemur left. Okay. Aww. Okay, but I can't. Where's the Where's the button to take out a loan? Give running money. a zoo is hard. This is difficult. Oh, loan. Here we go. Oh God. Oh really? We're getting into this now. <laughs> well, we've oh, got twenty no. minutes left of the stream. Why don't we just? Okay. Yeah. Let's go big. Eighteen percent interest. Fifty grand. Yeah, let's, let's do, do it. it. Okay. You know, let's, right, let's we're gonna pause it. this. <laughs> Zoe, did you see? So I found uh -huh. out earlier today. Uh, uh, so Seb googled what what gauge means in french oh yeah and it means pledge so okay. what do you think what do you think mortgage means um hang on isn't the first bit of that word mort yes does it mean death pledge right <laughs> fucking hell <laughs> you don't need to be so like you know accurate on, about on it, it right <laughs> <laughs> that is terrifying that is absolutely terrifying okay there we go we've got now we've got a vet place. Uh, Bro Brock Sisson says, odds of you coming to any Australian convention after this stream, right around zero, aren't they? <laughs> yes, pretty much. I'd okay. still go. I'd, I'd love, I need to go to Australia at some point. And there is an Aussie PAX. So, you know, if they ever yeah. start back up again, I'm totally going. I'll just, we'll just, we'll just like be watching around every corner for any spiders. <laughs> any terrible things. Okay, let's. Or let's, magpies. Maybe I should put down another staff room here. Which is the cheapest one? This is basically the same amount. And this is why I shouldn't be trusted by money. I'm like, eh, it's basically the same amount. It's like 200 mm -hmm. pounds more, but basically the same, you know? Monica, who I, I gather, because um, uh, they've been giving us quite a few tips uh, throughout the stream, says, I do hate how much you have to micromanage in this game because the keepers, as well as the mechanics, don't really manage to get to where they need to be no. on their own. <laughs> you, need, you need to kind of guide them, don't you? To be like, okay, yeah. now go over here. That's it. Good person. You're finally going to the right place. Okay, we've got a staff room now. 
Nice. Uh, let me go to zoo. Why are you getting angry? I'm doing it. Susan Waddle? Well, like, wh I don't, what am I supposed to do about that? I'm too so tired, I need a rest. Where are you? What's so oh, is it because she doesn't have a staff room? Yeah, I'm just... Uh, let's get rid of the scary loan bit. Uh, yeah. Work zone. Edit work zone. And let's put that staff room. <laughs> yeah. I can't believe how quickly we got, like, huge loans out. <laughs> Well, and look, I, at how, look at how much of it's gone already. <laughs> yeah, a big, a big chunk of it's gone, but that's fine. Well, look, Suzanne Waddle, where are you? Yeah. AA says, how come I don't see koalas? We can't afford them yet. We can't. We're so bad at this. <laughs> okay, you, where are you? Well, why are you in here? Look, I've got a staff room for you. It's right over here. Look. <laughs> Where's the uh. center staff room button? Zoe, you would love to see in the chat. Everyone, uh, all the Aussies in the chat are saying you would be welcomed. Oh, you would be welcome to Australia. You. Uh, oh. Thank you very much. Um, okay, clearly no one wants to have some loony balloons, so let's just let's just acknowledge that this was a failed enterprise. Oh no! And delete the, uh, nobody wants thing. nobody wants any fun balloons. Nobody right, well, we're taking balloons. that money back. So let's yeah. see what else we can make for them. Maybe some food stalls. Planet. Okay. Planet food Zoo. food sounds like a better enterprise. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Um, People wonder, always need food. They don't always need balloons. Exactly. Uh, These are just. I was. That's a little little insight into into uh, economics with me as an expert. Yeah. I was reading some um, like tips about like you know what to do with Planet Zoo and stuff and how to make sure it's a good place. And um, one of them was that your visitors apparently love stupid hats. So the guide was like, as soon as you can build a stupid hat place, build a stupid hat place. Like oh. just, just go for it. And then, do you see them like wandering around with stupid hats? With stupid hats on, yeah. Yes. Which is incredible. Looney balloons. No one likes that. <laughs> uh, okay. So we've got toilets, information, drink stalls. Uh, let's maybe they want an ATM. Maybe they want an ATM to get some money out from. Okay. Yeah. Let's see if this works. Uh, and maybe I can put in some signs that are like, come get your food. Chief Beef, okay. <laughs> Chief Beef. Isabel right CW says, I just like I just like one cute, if deadly, Aussie animal before the stream ends. Well, you, yeah, we have a croc. That kind yeah. of counts. Kind of a little bit. We'll see. Well, we need to get ourselves like on an on a level. On a high enough level that we are. Economically speaking, financially where, speaking. Before where are you going? Go. Where are you going? You work there. What? Stop. <laughs> Go back. We spent a higher salary. Oh no. What are you doing? What? What? What do you mean time spent idle? You work here. Workload you... breakdown. Yeah. What? Bah. Bah. Get. <laughs> Go work. Why are the? Why can? There's so much micromanaging. Why do we have to spoon feed you this information? Yeah, why can't you just work in the place? Chief Beef One. Chief Beef one. Work in Chief Beef. Unassigned oh, staff. Go to Chief Beef. You Claudia Frank? Oh god, hang on, right. Maybe if I edit the work zones, this will work. Oh god. <laughs> this is very stressful. Oh. Who knew that managing Oh uh, Planet Zoo just crashed. I was wondering. Yeah. That's... Uh, okay. Everyone enjoy my desktop, by the way. And now Aoife's gone a little bit weird. Hang on a second. Uh -oh. Let me just see if that. There you go. Aoife's back at least. Hi. Uh, Planet Zoo, <laughs> why did you crash? I know I wasn't. Does it need, was does it... It need updated really quick? Because well, the game is technically out now. Maybe, yeah. Let me. Uh, let me just. It, it could, we place. couldn't handle Chief Beef. That's they what couldn't happened. deal with it. They couldn't deal with it. In the meantime, <laughs> everyone, please enjoy my amazing fact thing. An error occurred while updating. Okay, well... Oh, it was updating. Okay. Okay, let me just do this. We'll just try and launch it again. Everyone, this is behind the yeah. scenes with Zoe and Aoife. Uh, <laughs> it's a fun time. Yeah, you can see all uh, the other games. I like that it was just peeking over you the top there. You were just having a little <laughs> look. <laughs> I got you back up, though. That's fine. Okay, well, maybe maybe, uh, maybe now we can like get like some... If it's updating, we can maybe get some new stuff in exactly, there as well. Yeah. Really quick. Okay. <laughs> let's get rid of this place. Yep. Oh god. It's a nice desktop you have though. For a second I was like, Eva, what if it doesn't save any of the stuff we've done? <gasps> I'm sure it will have. It must have autosave. It must. 
No, it will must. have done. It will have done. It's fine. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, this is okay. <laughs> I'm now very, very tense. Shift Shift says oh, that's a creepily that. clean desktop. I don't like lots of stuff on my desktop. No, I do. I agree. I, I, I delete like stuff it. off my desktop all the time. Okay, so, well, it, it, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. So I'm trying to ascertain where it's saved. Where are we up to? Do we have lemurs? Where's the... Yes, we have lemurs. Okay, but this bit over here is like... I think it might have auto-saved like 10 minutes later, but that's... That's as fine. As long as we didn't lose all the progress, then it's fine. Okay. That's fine. We still got our loony balloons, though. This was still in the loony oh, balloons God. era. No! You know? And we don't okay. have a loan. Okay, so we are going to oh, just... Oh, okay. Let's just cut that as soon as possible. Yeah. This is like a do-over. They're letting us have a do-over. Okay, and that's vendors, good. That's good. Uh, I don't know what you're doing, so I'm going to fire you. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see if that update added um, some animals. Simon's coming what? through with a fun fact about koalas. Oh, yeah, they go poop for when it. They're asleep. They poop when they're asleep? Yeah. Wow. That is multitasking that I admire yeah. quite a lot. Yeah. That's less time wasted when you're awake, which Very I'm all impressed. about. Okay, so. Habitat clean loneliness is a disease risk. Well, uh, just FYI, Zoe, you need to share with me so I can see. Oh, you okay, of course, yeah. I don't know, <laughs> Aoife, I don't know why that's an issue. You know, you should just be able to. I know. I'm just like, hmm. Okay. Hive mind. There you go. Let me share with you. Can you see now? Perfect, yes. Great. Uh, and you've disappeared from my window. I might be I behind, just... yeah, the... Uh, the thing. Display capture two. Oh, let me just move this down here. Nice. Where are you? You have absolutely disappeared. I'm just going to add you in real quick again. Okay. Uh, let me find you. Oh, man. This is intense, chaotic, chaotic vibes. It's fun. Yes. This is, this is exciting. All the things. All the things. It okay, probably, like, again. when you recropped me, maybe I've just jumped out of the... I think it might have just freaked out. But... Yeah. Um, let me... Oh, and now everyone can see all this stuff too. Hey, everyone! Hi! Having fun. Peek behind the curtain. Peek behind the curtain, indeed. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'm stealthed. I'm yourself. wearing stealth. You are still there, uh, but it's <laughs> fine. Okay, let me try this again. Let's add window capture. But yeah, there's, um, it's a lot of, uh, like, micromanaging when it comes to this, which is kind of okay yes. it's the kind of thing you enjoy but um well i think it's just about kind of pacing yourself right and sort yeah. of i the way i play these games is i i build a thing and i get all that really good before yeah. moving on to the next thing um which in this is really a balancing act go. because people come to the zoo to see more than one thing so it's like oh, you're back now know. everyone can see you yeah okay what are you doing you better be cleaning some stuff up they're just 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 having a wee think Looking this at some flamingos. We really need to request a mechanic. I might just, I might just. Oh, am I, are we losing money or are we gaining money? Sarah says, "I have a koala fact. Honestly, this stream was made for my bullshit. <laughs> because koalas have sex vertically in a tree. After ejaculation, the male produces a plug, which glues his sperm inside the female. No, no, I no, I no, no. just refuse, just no. refuse, absolutely no." That's amazing. <laughs> That's God. Nature is Makes terrifying. Sense. Gravity, you know. Okay, you for a start can stop walking away. You are work. Okay, good. He's. I had okay. to hire a mechanic so that this could get fixed, but that's fine. Do your um, thing. And we are very slowly gaining to money make again. Money. Yeah, it's going up and down, and up and down. But it's are you jinxed of... us? Yeah, it's going down yeah, again. God <laughs> damn it. Okay. Um, we've got some donation things. Let's. Can we try getting one more animal? Yeah, let's type? let's build another animal type. Um, let's pause. Let's see what other animal we can have. Um, what should we want an enclosure for? Maybe something quite smallish. Yeah. A tortoise. You can get tortoises in Australia, right? Yeah, sure. Of course you can. <laughs> uh, let's do a tortoise. So first, let's build a little enclosure. Let me just get rid of these to get some money back. To get a whole four dollars each back. Okay. Oh wow! There you go. I mean, don't spend it all at once. Four dollars—that doesn't seem right. Don't spend it all at once. Um, 
power source failed. Which power source failed? Transformer? Is it this one? I barely okay. know her. Mm. Okay, let's build a uh, let's build a giant tortoise habitat just here. You know, people can see it. They can yeah. do all the things. Right. Let's build it out of some This is cheap. Wood logs. Talk is cheap. Oh god, can you imagine if I could actually do overhead announcements in this like people were suggesting? How I would, would be obsessed be? with that. I re I re we would lose lose business very fast, but it would kind of be worth it. Maybe it'll be like people would like it as a business plan because they'd be like, you know, they say it as it is. They don't try to lie to us. They're not. That's true. They're not trying to make it appear anything it's not. Um, yeah, yeah. Okay. Unfortunately, that does seem to work, especially yeah. in politics. It, oh fuck! Yeah, it's unintentionally became a political matter. Yeah. God damn it. Okay, I'm going to build some paths for the staffs. Paths yeah. for the staff. Yeah. Paths for the staff. Okay. And then barriers. <laughs> uh, oh, there, there we go. De Debbie says the only koala fun fact I know is that they're chlamydia carriers. <laughs> and then, and then Priscilla replied, "That's not really a fun fact. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fact. It's not a. It fun is certainly fact, a fact. Though. To be fair, though, very few facts are fun." Exactly. Although a lot of these animal facts have been oh, No, quite I didn't fun, mean to, to do this. Fair. No, no, no. I didn't mean to do this. Uh, quick trade. There we go. Quick trade. Confirm. Okay. I accidentally adopted a hyena, but it's okay because we fixed it. Oh, that now. well, yeah. It's fine. Uh, let's adopt this giant tortoise. Sent to the zoo. Or go in here. Tort. Tortoise. Okay, Tortoise. so we have another, another thing coming. Another tortoise. Let's speed up time. Oh, and what press do, play, that might help. What do tortoises need? Uh, like lots of leafy stuff, I think. Yeah. Leafy Can they get stuff. into that enclosure? Uh, yes, there's a gate here for them to oh, get cool. into. Uh, let me just add a donation box. There's <laughs> guest staff facilities, guest facilities. Oh my god, I want I want to like just reach into Sarah's brain. I did a wildlife biology degree of specializing in reproductive management. I'm full of use useless animal sex facts. I want to know all the different weird shapes their penises are. That's, yeah, exactly. Don't ducks have a corkscrew penis? Yeah, I think pigs yeah. do as well. Really? I think. Oh, God. Oh, God. You know, the thing is, like, I think I want to know the information, and then I know it, and I'm like, like no, no well. <laughs> I don't want to know this. I changed my mind. Um, and let's give them a ball. There you go. You happy now? Yeah, you're happy. How's nature doing Aww. for you? Nature's fine. Nature is good. Nature is fine here. Okay, it's kind what of bare, but you know, that's that's also fine. A hundred dollars for a beach ball? Piss off. Unbelievable. What? They can get in. Look, there's a way to get in right here. You're just lying to me, whatever. I'm gonna ignore you. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Bridget! <laughs> Everyone's out to get us Everyone. in this stream. God All we wanted duh. was some kangaroos, and we've just been well, foiled at every. We've got pass. five minutes left, and we're kind of not where well, we're not making money. No, we were making money very briefly, and then it didn't work. Uh, but yeah, that's our zoo, everyone. That's our that's our zoo, and we've got another important. That's alert. our absolutely financially <laughs> destroying zoo. zoo. Yeah, it's just it's just a big just a big suck hole for money. Where yep. we're just taken 50 grand and thrown it in and burned it what why don't i just take out a real quick loan and i can make our water better real quick uh where's the loans but what oh so so my firstborn yeah i'd love to yeah i'd love to thank you thank you very much oh Facilities. my god but yeah that's a. Uh... okay wh wh who's actually using the water okay over no here. the croc is and the flamingos are using the water okay so maybe if i build this like here there we go yeah, the, okay. Crocodile. Oh boy, I'm going to need to build two of these. Okay, this is me for the rest of the week. It's just trying to make this. <laughs> God damn. Oh, I, do okay, have, I go. do have fun with this game, though. I do kind of want to play it more, like, and actually make a, an impressive zoo. Yeah, exactly. Make one where you, like, you can show off on a stream instead of, <laughs> like, <laughs> this zoo. You can be like, okay, now everyone just, for two hours, I want you all to just look and admire yeah. this zoo. 
I think to be fair, right. yeah, this is much more interesting, you know? If mm -hmm. we'd already had, like, this amazing place built, then yeah. we would just be peering at, peering at things. You'd all be so bored. You'd be bored the whole time, yeah. you know? And you would not have, we would not have learned so many amazing animal facts. So many from good our animal friends. facts. Uh, but yeah, that's Planet Zoo, everyone. <laughs> Shift Chip says, we all want an update where we see this zoo properly running, right? Yeah. Maybe we, maybe, maybe we can. Maybe we can. Maybe. Lloyd Maeve says, if anyone asks, magpies stole all the money. Yes. They came in and they took it. That's exactly what happened. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching, everyone. Uh, hope you enjoyed seeing us run this zoo into the ground. <laughs> run this. Um, we did run it into the ground, yes. Yeah, that's what we did. That's what we did. Um, but yeah, we've got some really good stuff coming up on the channel this week. What have we got coming up, Aoife? Mm -hmm. Loads of things. We've got some more surgeon sim coming up which i'm yes. very excited about cannot wait for very that. much looking forward to that yeah and uh tell me why is out this week so we'll yeah. be playing a little bit of that too um i don't know if we can talk about the other things yet uh, i don't think the stuff so. that's coming on friday so we'll not do there's a couple of new things coming up but also we have a guest stream uh yes this week. I'm very excited Which we for can that. talk about. Yes, uh, that'll be on Thursday, so look out for that. Yeah, we have, uh, it's going to be great. All yeah. guest streamers, like some cool Surgeon Sim stuff, which is going to be completely, you know, sensible. No oh, yeah, chaos. no, totally, yeah. No, 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 we're, no. We're I'm legit sure. This kind of stuff, yeah. No innocent victims, no, no unnecessary deaths. So <laughs> I'd like to leave all of you with the greatest exhibit at all, at all in this zoo, which is our idiot guests. Look at them. <laughs> Stupid oh, wow. idiot guests. Stupid idiots peering out Stupid at a crocodile, not idiots. knowing that other animals are just down there. There's loads of stuff down here, but no, you don't care, do you? You don't care. So we get, the, get on the intercom. You don't tell care. them, tell them all. You're idiots. <laughs> okay, everyone. <laughs> Goodbye, and thank you so much for watching. We will see you next time. Bye. Bye.